Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's my day off and I think it's time to adventure all the way to the outer limits of my city to check out another independent yarn shop. So we are waiting for a bus because public transportation. Uh, we are gonna get some coffee and then we're gonna hop on a second bus to get out to that edge of the city and see what it's like. Um, when I was peeping photos, it looks like they sell the cones of cotton yarn, and if they do, like, yes, that'll be glorious. Um, but I am interested to see what they have for, like, hand-dyed and other stuff that I can't get in the big box, boys. Had a moment, because Google tells me that, um, this is where the yarn store is. There's no yarn store there. Um, it's over there somewhere. So now we gotta go find out which unit it's in. Found it. That's it. That's it right there. Alright, so that may have been a mistake, and by that I mean I just spent $100 on yarn. None of which I needed. Um, two chunks of are definitely only going to be projects for me because they are expensive! Um, but I'm done here now, so I think we're gonna go find some coffee, because my bus is lined up really well downtown, so I didn't stop for coffee yet. Um, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Maybe, maybe the bus to the mall will come super quick and then I'll just go to the mall. Um, but I'll show you what we got when we get home. Right, we're home. Oh, that's a lot of cleavage. And then I thought I'd show you what we got at the yarn shop because I have a little bit of time before running out to the gym, hence the change. Uh, so I got some things just for me. So we got, we got this one here. She's so pretty. This is Rios and the 684 Chameleon color. It is a worsted weight and it's 100% superwash merino wool. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, it's made in Peru, apparently. Uh, let me see if I can find the recipient. Right, receipt. Because, um, yeah. So, and this one was $27, which is why I only got one, but she's really pretty. I have no idea what I'll make with it. Maybe I'll make some gloves and, or a hat, or both if there's enough. I don't know if there's enough, um, but that's really pretty. And then I got these three here, and these really pretty green and greeny yellow blend. Um, and this is the Barocco Vintage Baby Hand Paint. Um, they are 52% acrylic, 40% wool, and 8% nylon, also made in Peru. Um, these ones were $11.99 each. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah? Yeah. $11.98 each. Um, and I got three of those. Um, I think it's about a DK weight. Um... I, I don't know what I'm gonna make out of it, but um, it's definitely for me. Um, and then I realized I don't wanna make the top that I'm working on half and half, so I picked up another of the Lily Sugar and Cream in this hot purple color, and I grabbed another orange so that I can make a full top out of the orange. Um, and I'm hoping they match up well because I've been using Loops and Thread and this is Lily and Cream. That looks like it's gonna match up pretty well. And it's the same colors, different company branding on them. So I got those. 
Um, they were $3.50 each. And then I got these. This is, this is um, Sirdar Happy Chenille. They're just like tiny little 15 gram balls. Um, and they're adorable. I figured these would be really great for making keychain sized plushies for the Pride Market. So I got two yellows and a black so I can make some bumblebees because I always go through more yellow than the black. I got two different shades of green. So this is like a lovely grassy green and this is a limey green. So these will make some tiny frog keychains. Um, and then I got two blues. This is like a really pastel minty blue. And then this one's like a nice blue blue. And a silvery white to make some little tiny whales. Because those will be cute, 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 cute. Um, these ones are $2.50 each. Which I feel like is ridiculous for this tiny bit of yarn. But um, it's new. I've never used it before. It's... Where is it from? West Yorkshire. So this is from England. <laughs> and um, I think that it's just adorable. They also make these tiny balls in cotton and like the, the rainbow of colors that they have with cotton is just amazing. Um, but I wasn't looking for cotton for these. But yeah, that's everything. I spent $100 that I didn't really need to spend. But look at the pretties that I got out of it. Anyway, that's, that's it for today's little adventure. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.